News, Leaders in Learning, is brought to you by CapEd Credit Union. Every year, young Idaho filmmakers put their skills to the test in the CapEd High School Movie Trailer Contest. KBOI2's Abigail Taylor shows us the winning entry in this action-packed Leaders in Learning. <laughs> I was a little worried about mine because I wasn't sure if people would get the story, if there wasn't enough, and that it almost ruined it being the fact that it was an actual movie. Justin Buss, a junior at Mountain View High School in Meridian, isn't new to filmmaking. I've been working towards this stuff since about second grade. I was taking little pictures of my Legos and throwing them together into stop motions. Recently, he took a shot at something he hasn't tried before. A Hollywood-style movie trailer for a competition put on by CapEd. I just went through and watched as many movie trailers as possible, the ones I really enjoyed that didn't give away too much of the movie. He took what he learned and broke apart one of his short films. Then he pieced it back together to tell a story of its own. With an hour and a half worth of footage, most movies can put together a pretty good trailer, use plenty of footage and scenes without spoiling much. But it's really hard with 10 minutes to fill up almost two minutes with footage when that's, you know, a lot of your film going into that trailer. And all his hard work paid off. Boneyard won first place out of 25 submissions from all over Idaho. And with that came this big check something this aspiring filmmaker says he is grateful for. I think one of the hardest challenges in most of the films is creating a budget for it. I try to shoot with no budget, but sometimes you just you need a few props or costumes or some more fake blood. So it's really nice to have a lot of money to work with. What I'm gonna do is probably buy some new lights and equipment and uh, costumes for my next movie. Abigail Taylor, KBOI 2 News. Now, Justin says his long-term goal is to direct an action movie for the big screen, and I'll bet he does it. Do you know a local school